you're going to get flags that look like this. <laughs> and, and, and what do I do with that? Here, let me show you. This is the first thing I do when parents arrive. So I open it up and I put my flags to the side. Now I have a flag belt. Okay, looks just like this. Okay. I open this up and I am going to wrap it around my player's waist. Just like this. Now as you can see, it's not fitted. And I am going to pull it, okay, tight. But now, look what's happening. I've got this extra little flag. Once I put my other flags in, now I've got three flags, three things I need you to bring to your meet and greet. Number one is duct tape. Number two, scissors. Number three, a sharp. Now here's how we do it. Let's just do it live. Here we go. So I have it wrapped up. I've decided that this is comfortable, okay? They've tucked in their jersey, they've got it on, and now, boom, I've got this little, hmm, this little tail. So what I like to do is, I decide, all right, hmm, I'm about right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut this off, this extra little tail, I'm gonna cut it off about maybe two inches away from my clip. Let's do it. You will literally be doing this at your meet and greet with your parents. Hi, how are you doing? I'm Coach D. Very nice to meet you. What's up? Hey, man. How are you doing? You ever played before? Oh, what's your favorite team? Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Cool. But now I've got this. I cut. Now, I'm going to take my duct tape. Sometimes I bring like two or three duct tape two or three scissors and two or three sharpies so that I can have multiple doing it at once. Because if I'm trying to get 10 players to do this and I only have one set, it's going to take forever. Okay? So I like to have a couple. So preparation, my dad always said, you know, the six P's, proper priority planning prevents poor performance. So what am I doing now? I am now going to wrap this around. Okay times and you can make it you know more or less basically you're going to duct tape it just like this so it doesn't move now I'm going to take my sharpie okay, and I'm just going to write their name on it Bobby Evan Sam Samantha whatever now they're ready to go so that is the way that it should look hey coach do i need to put the flag you know the names on the flags no nah, because they're all the same so that doesn't matter too much another thing i would do really quick is these are going to be tight they're going to be tight to, to put in see it doesn't naturally just go in so i would just take it a few times especially for my younger my younger groups i would just do this a couple times just have the parents do it a couple times as you're getting kind of warmed up and you're doing your meet and greet just do it a couple times so that it gets a little bit more loose cool there you go that is what you'll do at the very beginning of your meet and greet after that what i'll